Hey guys, Rise Up 44 here, and you're watching me on youtubecom slash 44 Today I am playing Shadow Blade Reload on the PlayStation 4. Uh, this game just hit the PlayStation Store a few days ago, uh, at the end of May, and I figured why not check it out, play a little bit, share my thoughts with you guys. Shadow Blade is an action platformer. It's set in a striking world where the ancient te teachings of ninjas and samurai clash upon a modern landscape. Sprint through stages littered with traps, slaying enemies along your path without hesitation as Kuro, the Blade of Shadow. So that's what they wrote about the game. Well, I figured I'd share that with you. Why not? We're going to jump right in, play a little bit, and I'll let you know what I think about it. Uh, De Dead Mage Inc. are the creators, are the developers. I've heard, good, I've heard really good things about these guys, so follow them on Twitter, search them, seek them out, give them props, and support them in their endeavors as an indie developer, like you should with all awesome indie, de indie developers coming to console. So let's jump in. Story mode, let's go. Level one. So we're gonna get a score, a time, and a completion percentage. Normal, hardcore, master. All right, normal is the only thing unlocked. Level one, let's rock. A warrior is worthless, is worthless unless he rises above the others and stands strong in the midst of a storm. I like these little storyboard scenes. That's pretty cool. Oh boy. What the? Dude with the pink hair looks like a character from Borderlands. The master is in danger. Hurry, you must reach his chamber, Kuro. Alright. You think you have mastered the game. Play Shadow Challenges to test your ninja abilities. Press the button to start. <clears throat> Here we go. Alright. Square. Square is to, uh... Slash, X is to jump, circle nothing yet, ninja stars with triangle, you only get a selected amount, dash is R1, alright let's restart just now that I know the buttons, alright here we go, double jump is a thing, smelly jack. What a name. Creative. One hit? Kill them? What? That must be a checkpoint. Whoa. That's pretty cool. That must be some kind of collectible, obviously. These guys are all turned around, let's look at that. Maybe just because it's level one, it's not really. Oh, he threw me! That was awesome. That was cool, too. This game's kind of intense. I like the dash. That's pretty cool. Haha, <laughs> Ninja Star's your face. Oh, I ran out. He got me. Damn it. That was awesome. I think I stole a spear or something. Whoa. Let's see here. 
that was cool. Ninja stars! Uh oh, here we go. What the heck? I want to do that way though. R1. How do I go up there? through that with a dash that was cool I jumped over him kind of sliced down oh you can jump oh that's cool it's like a um a what's it called move uh Think of it. I'll think of it. Oh, he threw me back. Yeah, we were just talking about it last night. We're rebooting it. Um. Out of war. The um, thing where you pull them close to you. It's like pretty much just like out of war. I wonder if I have to go back down there and get that again or if I have it once I get it. Nope, I gotta go get it after you die. Until you get to a next checkpoint, I'm assuming. I can definitely see the value of doing this quick and like how hard it's going to be to try to do this quick. All right. Mission complete. Kill points, final score, completion, death penalty, I died twice, 200. All right, you know what? Should I go? I want to know how you get that first green you know we'll come back to this next level <clears throat> Kuro can run up walls hold dash button while air dashing into a wall oh really hmm That was awesome. Kind of like a scorpion throw. Get over here! Why did I not make it up there? How do I make it up there? There's gotta be a way. Oh, 
that was cool. Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo. I don't know how I did that. That was intense though. Oh my gosh, how did I make that? Whew. My heart was pumping there. I didn't have that ninja star, I would have kept. I would probably would have still been fighting that guy. Jeez. That was brutal. Uh, controls are pretty easy to uh, like get used to which is not always the case with games sometimes with games like these the controls feel clunky or the button combinations just don't make sense like a game I played recently not gonna mention any names um, but this just feels right I mean I caught on really quick there's they work really well it's smooth like there's no janky button pressing, mashing, it's it's right on. I'm very impressed with this game. That was pretty cool. I like threw a ninja star and then hit him at the same time. That was really cool. Get over here! Alright, level two. Did I die that time? No. Yes, I did, didn't I? Plus one. Oh, okay. So I don't get it. I don't know. I don't remember if I died. Alright, moving on. Level two complete. Alright, moving on. Never worry about running out of Shuriken. Kuro Shuriken regenerate over time. Shuriken. Shuriken. <laughs> sure. Somebody comment below this video and let me know how it's supposed to be said. Shuriken. Shuriken. Jeez, I should know that. Here we go, going down.
What? I like touched the spikes. How did I not die there? first green secret in this level three come on why are you jumping that way though there we go I didn't even challenge me you kind of give me a freebie Oh shit, shoot, sorry, excuse my language. Man, I am, my score is gonna be pitiful. that move. not the one. I didn't know it. Darn it all. How do you get up there? Okay, you can do that. What? That was dope. Alright, so towards the end of the level, as you see, the second and final green collectible thing is at the second trampoline, I believe. Oh, what do we got here? A boss battle of some sort? Who is this guy? Shiro. Mission complete. 900. That's B. Alright, so that's level 3. And that one was actually really fun. Level four. Oh, no, more storyboards. Join me, son. Join me in teaching me. Blink a little honor. That's so sick. That's so badass. I love storyboards. This art style is phenomenal. You must now devote yourself to protecting the claws on the clan's honor. I'm sorry, a medallion. Take this young shadow. They must not obtain it. 
run, run, and hide it somewhere safe. You'll know when the time to act arrives. Bam! What? A dude in a mech suit? What is this? Kiyamoto. Oh, dang. Dude's got one eye. Like, what's his name? How nice to see you again, Mr. Shiro. Come now and sample my staff's wrap. Run, son. Take to the winds. What is this? Metal Gear? <laughs> Just kidding. That's pretty cool, though. I'm really, really digging these storyboards to tell the story. This is really cool. I am hooked. That is for sure. Whoa. Whoa. I failed that. Not doing so good at the beginning of this level. Sick. something back there but I have no idea how to get to it. I need to go back. It's gonna drive me nuts if I don't at least check it out. See there's a green thing up there. I wanna know why. Oh okay that's why. So there's your first green collectible <clears throat> for level four. Whoa, I just got blocked off, so I'll see here. That was so cool, I like stabbed him in the top of the head. out of this room. I can't. I gotta kill everybody, I guess. There we go. That's what I had to do, just beat them all. That was cool. Adds a love, another um, part to it. Stinger. What's this guy, got a shotgun? Wow. He blew me up. Oh, it's like a chaser bullet. Okay, you wanna play that game?
Oops. Come on, dude. I should have been able to jump. Smartass Ninja Trophy. Alright, so I did something there that gave me the Smartass Ninja Trophy. Oh, I know what I did. I used his own rocket bullet thing, his, his seeker bullet. I used it to kill him. And I got the Smartass Ninja Trophy. Sweet. So, that's how you get the Smartass Ninja Trophy. Son of a... This is going to be tough here. Yeah, that's how you do it. Alright, I got to do this quicker. Do it before I can even shoot me. Ah! There it is. That's how you do it, son. Took me several tries, but I got it. That's gonna be a huge time bonus. Whatever. And that is your next green collectible. Level five, maybe? Uh oh! Shoot. Why did I let that guy scare me? I got nervous there. The arch. major death bonus there. I mean death penalty bonus. Oof. Oof, a C. While sliding down a wall, press down and jump buttons at the same time to instantly drop off. Okay. Here we go, level five. Awesome. There's your first green collectible of level five. What we got? Snitchy bastard. Okay. That's a heck of a name. That was awesome combo. That was a... That was sick. That's all I gotta say. That was sick. That was awesome. I don't know what's going on there, but this should be interesting. Wow. 
right through your head. Woo! How did I get out of that jam alive? No! That was a nice little combo there too. What? All right, there's your second green collectible for level five. No. Come on! Take that. Man, that was close. <laughs> That's it for level five. Wow, that was intense from start to finish. And that's going to do it, guys. Even though I got a C, I'm happy with that. Thanks for watching. As you guys can tell, I love this game. I'm hooked. I can't wait to play more. You guys, go out and buy it. $14.99 in the PlayStation Store. You can't go wrong with a game like this. Dead Mage Inc., great developers. As you see, their storyboards right on. Tells a good story. The mechanics, from what I said, you guys gotta trust me. These buttons are right on. There is no janky button mashing, pressing. Everything is smooth, right on. The buttons make sense. The combos, everything, it fits together. And it's just hard enough. And also there's two more levels and I'm already finding this a little bit challenging. So you can imagine how the replayability, you know, it's there. Um, challenge yourself and just keep going forward man this this is a great game shadow blade reload check it out for yourselves guys you won't be disappointed again thanks for watching it's been rise up 44 and you're watching me on youtube.com slash nalio 44 hit that like button subscribe follow me on twitter at rise up 44 and peace to next time